Hello, welcome back to the homestead. We wanted to give a more close-up view of the house that we constructed for the pigs. We got the idea from Mack Hill Farms on YouTube and you can pull them up to see uh, hers as it's different than ours. Uh, it's made from two hog panels, a 16 by 10 foot tarp, six T-post, and some rough sawed lumber that we made with our sawmill. So as we come closer, we see that the house itself is filled with straw. This gives the pigs an ample space to where they can come in when it's cool at night and they have shelter from the weather. The back wall is a windbreak that faces to the west. The opened end is to the east. The tarp itself is zip tied all along the edges to hold the tarp down so it doesn't flap and the hog panels themselves are zip tied together so that they do not move. The structure is very sound, it flexes with the wind and as you can see we just use some mechanics tape to attach it to the walls in the back. The straw bales helps in that the pigs don't root up against the bottom of the inside of their house. Well, at the same time, it gives them a place to play where they can jump up on and jump back down. Let's take a look at the back. The back of their house, as you can see, is just a simple wall of rough sawed lumber that we used uh, two T-posts to anchor into the ground because the pigs, they like to scratch their back on the inside and push outside. So this is what keeps them from just pushing the wall down. As I said, it was very affordable to build. I don't think we have $40 in the whole structure. Uh, it's very simple. We built it in an afternoon and very durable. Again, we built this last year uh, for our first group of pigs, and this is the second year. Uh, maybe next year uh, we'll replace the tarp and just put a new tarp in its place. Uh, but anyway, I thought you might want a closer look. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.